13. Golf is a puzzle. That was his seventh shot. It's confusing, overwhelming, and seemingly impossible. Answer me! 144 professional golfers at Colonial for this year's Charles Schwab Challenge, including two-time PGA Tour winner John Sendon. John Sendon at 13. The 49-year-old from Australia now lives in Flower Mound with his wife Jackie and their son Jacob. I was very uh, fortunate to receive an invite to play this week. The family is all smiles now, but... We've come a long way. In the spring of 2017, they were confused. Jacob was having severe headaches. So they took him to Children's Health in Dallas. He was diagnosed with a cancerous brain tumor. They were told he had just two hours to live, a prognosis that was overwhelming and seemingly impossible. They said like there's fluid in the brain and they were tell telling me like what's going to happen. Like this is, this is, it's really, really kind of scary. After months of chemo and radiation, the tumor shrunk from the size of a golf ball to smaller than a pea. God bless the, all the, the medical staff that um, saved his life. To help occupy his time in the hospital, Jacob had a Rubik's Cube. Within a week, he mastered it. Have your mom or dad ever solved one in front of you? No, they have not, <laughs> unfortunately. There's been, been plenty of attempts, but no success. Weeks after the diagnosis, Rubik's Cube patches could be found on the shirts and hats of golfers around the PGA Tour. A show of support for Jacob. Three years later, Jacob is in good health and good spirits, playing music, playing golf like his dad, and still crushing the Rubik's Cube. Because no matter how confusing and overwhelming it may be, perseverance can accomplish the seemingly impossible. In Fort Worth, I'm Jonah Javad.